Hey, baby, I hear the blues are calling. Toss salads and scramble, baby, I... What's up guys, welcome back to Benjamin with Babish, where this week we're taking a look at Chinese Turkey, aka Ramey Rashid. You want me to do what? While trying to make as few double entendres as possible. First up, we're going to address the mysterious meat sauce, which according to the legend of Nick Tahos, is made from that awful store-bought meth, or concoction that offends all five of the senses. So if I could just tell you that this guy should like me, but I'd rather show you. Then, according to Boothin's recipe, we stack two slices of at the top of that, mess, and then start all over again. Six times, all told. So next up, we need to scald the Dermate Rashid. Sometime. No, he didn't say he never said it like that. <laughs> now, the faint of heart, you might want to look away because we've got a head-on young Dermate Rashid, into whose cavity we're going to dump about wholly unnecessary four different kinds of rice. Don't do what I'm doing. That is, don't fry the veal chocolate salty balls because it fills your stanky ass detritus. Now, this guy did not turn out as evenly browned as a traditional pig mate Rashid, because it had not been allowed to air dry ah! at night. But the skin is still super crisp, and the meat is nice and juicy. Fill up a pancake with duck onions and a banana, along with uh, some freshly uh, peeled ginger. Again, air drying the night or up to three days is going to give you darker skin and more flavorful meat, but as far as shortcuts go, the oh shit, I have a deathly banana allergy, because these things are going straight to my thighs before I blow up. Hey Andrew, I, like the rest of the world, am not allergic to bananas. 